Welcome to Fun International. As we start this season, here are some of the teams to watch as we go around the globe. From down under, in Australia, it's Barker Redbacks, 46-13, causing quite a stir. Their reveal video in 2018 influenced a team update, and these guys are tied for most blue banners in one season. They remained the most dominant team in their home country of Australia, where they won one regional and was finalist in another. Who else could possibly stand neck and neck with a track record like that? None other than 5985, Project Brucephalus, the captain that beat 4613's alliance and picked up a WFFA in the process. Japan's not a country we see often in the world stage, but 6909 is changing all of that as a rookie team, winning highest seeded rookie, themesless finalist, and rookie all-star in Hawaii. We couldn't move on without talking about Sakura Tempesta. Making our way to China and Taiwan, first we have Stargazer, 55-22. They were finalists at the Shenzhen Regional and at the two China Aussie, where they won the international bracket in Hangzhou and the China Robotics Challenge in Shenzhen. Greatest of all time, or GOAT, 6907, seated first in Shanghai and were the first local captains of a winning alliance in China. This year may not see a regional in China, but you will see 6907 in the playoffs. Before moving on, we have 4253 Raid Zero with some real globe trotting, with places like New York, Hawaii, Sydney, and Detroit, the cats out of the bag with this team. Last year we saw them get a cling bling in Hawaii with no signs of slowing down. Spice Gears 5883 from Poland comes out swinging last year, double bannering in both Shenzhen and Shanghai regionals. With a strong program at home, let's see how they do at both regionals in Turkey. Dreams do come true. Last year's rookie all-star out of Ontario district, but not from Canada, the Afghan Dreamers 7329. This team overcame much just to join us in Detroit, and we will see them again this year at Istanbul. From Israel, one of the hardest districts in the world, 1577 not only won their district events, but also the district championship. They were number one overall in district points, but just behind them ranked second in overall district points. 1574 Miss Carr with their debut on Einstein last season. Both teams are going strong into next season. Last year's double banner in Turkey, their home country, takes us to the fourth dimension. 6429 beat out the rest, leading their alliance to defeat the boss, and we'll see them blasting off again into deep space. From the UK, we have 1884 Griffins and 1797 Phoenix from the same school. These guys have been around for a long time, longer than many in North America, and with their recent successes as Woody Flowers finalists, they are on the upswing for bringing home more hardware at Midwest this year. 1772, the Brazilian Trailblazers, and trailblazing is definitely what they do best. It may have been a while since the Brazil Regional, but these guys won Chairman's, WFFA, and finalist in Montreal. This year, they're heading back to old hunting grounds in Orlando, with each previous year taking something back home. These are just a few of the teams we have our eyes on. Let us know who you're watching, and we'll see you next time when we go Around the Globe.